silky, creamy. Josh, my girl. Shamiha, say fried rice Indian reinvent. Yes, fried rice Indian reinvent. No. I don't okay. think so. Hey everyone, welcome back to another video and today me and my best friend are going to have a buffet challenge in Ailanto. So you guys have met Shamiha in my previous video. She doesn't know what the challenge is so I'm gonna talk about the challenge when she's here but let's talk about where we are. So we are here at a newly opened restaurant, Ailanto. They do buffets every single day. And the interior is super nice. So the restaurant is located right above Yamcha in Gulshan. And they specialize in buffet items, especially like Thai, Chinese, Pakistani kebabs and all that. They also have a dessert section, also a life section. Super spacious as you can see. The view is super nice when you sit and eat and look at the view. The lighting's quite nice as well. Super excited to do the challenge with Shamiha because the challenge that we're gonna do, it's probably gonna be fun because we both have such different taste buds which is a very key factor in this challenge. So let's wait till she comes. She's always late. So we're just gonna wait for her and then talk about the challenge and then show you guys the food and start eating. But one thing to keep in mind, um, I did buffet videos before and the thing that I keep on saying, a lot of food goes to waste in buffet. So make sure to start with like small portions and then go back and take the ones that you like more because I see a lot of people just keeping piles of food on their plate and then just wasting it. So be mindful when you're in buffet. While we wait for Shamiha, let's show you guys the interior, the decoration and some of the food items. Shama is finally here. Asha Shama. <laughs> so, the challenge that we're gonna do, like I said, Shamiha and my taste buds are very different. I feel like in some cases it's quite different. Do you agree? Yeah, absolutely. So we're gonna have five rounds: appetizers, Indian, Thai Chinese, light kitchen, and desserts. So, what are we gonna do? When it's time for appetizers, mm -hmm. you're gonna go and grab your appetizers. Just right. add one plate, one plate. One plate. One plate. Okay. Appetizers just. Like I'll, I'll pick for yeah. whatever I want. I'll, whatever you want to eat. Mm -hmm. Same, I'll just go and pick whatever I want to eat and then we're gonna exchange oh. and judge each, each other's taste and then you're gonna also judge and see who has the better plate. Okay. The same goes for all. Same rounds. goes for all the rounds. We're just gonna see who has the better taste bud. Yeah, so basically, we are just gonna exchange <laughs> plates. Yeah, of we're just gonna food. exchange plates of food. Okay. And the last time we went to have a buffet together, she couldn't eat because she had to pee, and then pee got up or she could realize so that she's still hungry. <laughs> yeah, so that happens. We're I'm gonna, so bad at buffet. We're gonna clear our bladders and then start eating. So it's time for us to do round one appetizers. So Shama's gonna grab a plate, I'm gonna grab a plate, we're bring the appetizers, then we're gonna switch a route. Guys, we're gonna start with the appetizers and then we're gonna move on to salad. But our appetizers are identical. This is what I got. I got a uh, wonton, chicken lollipop, satay, uh, fried morning glory, Thai soup, pineapple juice. And this is what Shama got. Same. Same. <laughs> literally, literally, same literally same. So there's nothing to exchange, we're just gonna have them. But I can't have pineapple juice. I thought you know it. Allergy? <laughs> I saw when you were taking Allergy? Oh, jump on Oh, I almost... I think I'm allergic. Maybe we Not can diagnosed. try. Not diagnosed. No, don't try. Not don't diagnosed, try. but... Don't try. Yeah. Oh, maybe we allergic to the 
in my I think it's in my head. Yeah. Actually, let's try the soup first. Exchange? No, I keep. I got more chicken. It ain't my taste. <laughs> it's okay. No, it's a taste bud. <laughs> Thai soup. Let's dip our wonton into it. Do you dip it? Yeah. Thai soup without wonton is incomplete. Hmm. I don't want to try these. This is actually surprisingly good. Fried morning glory. You can have it on its own. Morning glory Bangla chip. Shak pata? No. No. It's surprisingly good, right? Hmm. But morning glory is only good Chinese. Chinese dishes you use for Japanese dishes you use for it. Satay. Not bad. Not bad. It's a nice flavor. Shamak can mix. Hey, what should I try? Is it a dry one? It's falling apart. Chips and mutton. Yeah, it's very light actually. I was saying that can I talk about the plates because it's amazing. Look at this. Yeah, bag of it. Shop bag of it. So wait. So we're ready for our main one round, which is gonna be not Indian, it's gonna be like Thai or Chinese or whatever they have. Which I'm super excited for because I saw some octopus there, which I really want to try. Excited. <laughs> oh, that's a fake. Oh my god. Let's go get it. But this looks good. I think it has seafood in it. Yeah. Ooh. It's got seafood and chicken in it. Mm. My bets. I'm not gonna take noodles. Crab. This looks fair. There you is lost. crab. And there we have beef hot, hot sauce. sauce. Okay, this is. Oh, dang. Crab is going to cost me, but it's going to be worth it. I'm going to also take the beef hot sauce. I didn't eat the paru, I guess. Okay. Take two names. I know Shamiya probably likes cashew nut salad. I do too. So, I'm going to take it. <gasps> there is squid basil leaf. I know you're going to go for this for sure. For sure, for sure. With your nemesis. <laughs> oh, it's in the Indian section. Like you <laughs> Try this. The Ooh, prawn red chili. Yeah, prawn red chili looks really nice. So they have like two kind of vegetables stir fry vegetable in Bangkok style. So I took one, I think that's enough. We're gonna try these giant ass prawns. One more because why not? This I'm gonna take. Are you like Indian or something? Yes. Shama, do you want to get No, I don't know what to get her actually. I think I got some pretty exciting things here. So this is my plate. You guys saw what I have. And like I said, she doesn't like rice so I know she took noodles. Oh, I'm not looking at I got you uh, cream pasta, crab salad, uh, squid, and yes. I told you, yeah, barbecue, barbecue, octopus. barbecue octopus. and high fried, Thai fried chicken. Exchange plates. <laughs> Shama plate at the same time. Sad. Yeah. I oh, like this out this way. <laughs> this way. <laughs> no, this looks good. Hmm. Let's start with you. Pasta. I'm gonna try the white pasta because that's the odd one out here. You know, I'm gonna try try it. Let me try the uh, salad. Yeah, it's really good seafood salad. Yeah, salad section, mm. it is salad in part. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Fresh. A bit tangy. Mm. I like the seafood salad. It's actually very nice. How's the pasta? Mm. It's alright. It's a bit amakashi too. It feels a bit sweet to me. I don't know if it just made it here. It's a bit sweet. sweet. Yeah, it's a bit sweet. You didn't get me the chicken. No, I'm trying to. I'm not getting it for you, Kim. Yeah, yeah, I'm know, getting I know. it for me. Looks Try good. the barbecue octopus. It looks very nice. 
Mm. Nice chewy. Nice and chewy. The smoky flavor. Nice marination. I really like it. Hi, Sish. Mm. I just had one. It's good. Smoky. And nice. So, so we what thought first of Hi, Sish. How is it? Uh -huh. I thought. I thought it's bulgogi, but it's good. Beef hot sauce. Mm. I like it. It's not spicy, but it's nice. Let's try the fried rice on its own. The fried rice has like seafood in it seafood as and well. Chicken, yeah. yeah, seafood and chicken. And it has a hot sauce flavor, mm. right? They, they it put has some a different flavor. Sauce or something. I like it. Yeah, let's try the prawn. Giant ass prawn. Mm. Meaty. And Can you go wrong prawns. with prawns? Very fresh. I like how they kept the flavor of the prawn intact as well. Like it's not doused in sauce. I like it. So who wins this round, Shama? Fair decision, Diva. So like I, I know I liked what you got me. What got you for got for yourself? I like what you got for yourself as a well, but you Maximum. could have gotten more. Better, better. <laughs> when options, options, options no, no. Oh. I don't want to have options to look. Oh, what's up? I don't know. Yeah. But oh, I skipped on the crab maybe because I saw that. Prawn miss kursi, uh -huh. vegetable miss kursi, chicken miss kursi, beef miss kursi. Shabhi miss kursi. That's the key, but by default, second plate winner. Ta-da! Next, we're going to have the live, ra live kitchen round, but that's not going to be a round because we just ordered dumplings, so we're just going to have them. One thing that we forgot to show you was the Sichuan style fish that Mr. Box just got right now. It's really nice. Sweet, spicy. It's nice. It has a Thai sweet chili flavor. Mm. If you like fish and you like the sweet chili kind of flavor, you're going to like it. So they do like live dumplings or momos in this section and they have like three to four items and we're gonna take like two of each and have them. I love momos, dumplings, dim sum, whatever you wanna call them. Excited to try. So we have the dumplings from our live kitchen right here. We have like a sui mai, vegetable sui mai, chicken dumplings, spicy chicken dumplings. We also have coconut momo like what coconut dumpling and some prawn hargao not hargao not hargao <laughs> <There. Hargao. laughs> <laughs> let's try the sui mai this is the veg or chicken chicken i think mm. try with this green turkey this is the spicy, spicy chicken, chicken dumpling. Also. Spicy chicken. Mm -hmm. I like the siumai. The wrapper was thin, nice. The filling was really great as well. They did not skimp out on the filling. Let's try the normal chicken dumpling. Yum. Maja? Yeah, it's so good. Normal chicken dumpling? Mm. Shama likes the spicy one, right? Yeah, I like the spicy one. Is it spicy? It has a kick. Like, yeah. Spicy chicken dumpling. Mm. I like the filling here nicer. It has a kick to it, slightly lemony. It's really good. We're gonna try the prawn hargao. <laughs> it's because of you. You ruined it for us. Okay, I'm curious. I'm the prawn hargao. Say hargao. Mm. I love prawn hargaus. Best of the bunch. Next, we're gonna try the coconut. It's very unique. Lots mm. of coconut. No accelerator person. Hey man, no accelerator coconut. <laughs> I like it. It's like narital and pita, but in dumpling form. It's nice. You like Nothing life altering, but it's nice. Shami have also said fried rice Indian reinvent. Yes, fried rice Indian reinvent. No. I don't Can think so. Chinese, uh, this is a style. Who is Indian restaurant? Fried rice. Khasha, I'm going to go. Huh? Huh? 
সুপার সফট melts in your mouth super flavorful love the spices in it next we're gonna since we already tried the beef one let's try the beef kofta as well not as good as the beef bihar but nice kofta i guess and let's try the vegetables sabzi korma hmm very familiar indian flavors in the vegetable i really like it like This kind of vegetable is my favorite like you know that creamy a bit spicy it's nice don't skimp on on indian vegetable or vegetable korma type curries this is a chicken curry i think curry dishes has like this thin cut of ginger which is a very i don't know prominent thing in the dishes so personally i like the vegetable more than the chicken curry among the thai chinese or indian i think i like the thai chinese more i mean don't get me wrong the indian food is really good i like them but i feel like the variety and the dishes in the thai chinese is what i would prefer like the like the squid basil curry then there is that prawn prawn, prawn salad prawn thing then the crab salad then the beef hot sauce fried rice the sichuan fish it was great it was so it feels very light it feels very Chinese, it's very and the flavors are like spot on yeah i'm going to just put it oh man and we still have desserts mori jabo desserts to share kore eta parbo na yeah desserts parbo na ala ala so which one would you prefer the thai chinese or no. the indian or the mixture like you brought thai indian chinese <laughs> thai indian chinese no uh, definitely the thai and i think they nailed the seafood Hmm. Uh, all the seafood. seafood items were really good octopus squid hmm. chicken very good thank you very much <laughs> i have to mention this they have like a lot of seafood in a lot of their items they did not skimp on on the seafood and the seafood actually tastes really good even in their salads they have a lot of seafood in their fried rice they have a dedicated seafood curries those are very nice so next we have the final round the dessert which we're all gonna share because or else we're just gonna die so we're gonna start with the creme brulee because they just made it let's see if it cracks ooh, ooh, ooh. yes yes bitch yes <laughs> silky creamy josh my god josh how cool are you guys is that good so bhala lagta hai i'm in coma <laughs> next we're going to try the cheesecake Nice mm, it looks nice and dense but I'm skeptical about desserts in buffets because a lot of people kind of mess up when it comes to desserts so let's see Ooh. not bad right not bad pretty nice Shamia doesn't like cheesecake so I don't think she's gonna like it Shamia has a green juice though Shamia cheesecake is texture to bhal lagen na let's try the red velvet I you know would would you call a cake a red velvet cake if it doesn't have cream cheese 
because that's the whole thing that makes a red velvet cake red velvet cake other than it's just a normal cake with red food color it's good it's tasty but it's it's a good cake but you need, need the cream cheese it's not red velvet cake <laughs> if you know what she you means, know you know chocolate, chocolate. mousse cake It's okay. It's okay. You can never go wrong with chocolate cake. Let's try the pina colada. Pina colada. Pina colada is really good. I tried it. I really enjoyed this. Pina colada actually key. Actually key. How many? Pina colada, not pina cotta. It's a pina cotta. It's not a pina colada. Pina colada is like a drink. ভিডিও I didn't know you were taking a picture. I mean, just hit a hit. Hit the button to hit corbo and then you hit. Sorry. <laughs> Flan. Pudding, pudding, pudding. Creme Flan. caramel. Flan. Shabas. Creme caramel, pudding. It's Flan. nice. I mean, we all have it dawat, so it's good. good. My mom's the best one. My favorite was the creme brulee. Hands down. Hmm. Hands down, my favorite was the creme brulee and the cheesecake was really nice as well. The panna cotta was nice as well. My top three mentions. And then they also have a lot of items which are like regular Bangla sweets like gajar halwa, shahi tukra, firni, gulab jamun and Mr. Box is going to try it all. Let's start with the gulab jamun. Half gulab jamun then. One half full then. It's not half gulab jamun. Malsa. Gulab jamun. A plus. Gajar halwa. B. Shahi tukra. I don't know how to eat it. I don't know how to eat it. I don't know how to eat it. This is surprisingly good though. Achha na, this is a A minus. Ye to maki all levels, all levels se result mona sasa. Initial grades, initial grades. Ha, shay to rest good. Mission. Mission over. I tell grade ko lo. Oh man, you need a A plus plus. It is not your grade. You need is really good. Top notch. Like Joto cheesecake bolo cream love. We need a top notch. For you maybe. Pura na pura beer bari fini mo to is so good. Beer bari tan fini mo. Tumar somoshya tumi beshi high five deshi mishti khao na. Na. Pura tumar issue ashole. Ha o deshi mishti khana. Ni amake eta expose korte chho ke no hai expose in me. It's good. It's good. Uh, fini ta I would go again for the fini. Anyway, yeah, that's the big one. Which one would you have again? Cabernet, hmm. uh, flan, <laughs> <laughs> Gajar Halwa, Shahi Tukra, Firni, Gulab Jamun, and Mr. Box. So guys, we're at the end of our buffet challenge at Islanto. I won, clearly. Shama Kai Thir Pui Rasi. Um, really loved the quality of the food even though items could be considered to be few but I love the quality of everything especially the seafood items are top notch love the decor service is great even though the price of the buffet is could be considered to be a bit high I mean it is a bit high I do like the quality of the food the taste of the food so if this is something that you would like to try out do visit Ailanto in Gulshan it's right above Yum Cha I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.